in an age of lawlessness and despair. The Empire of Man lay in ruins, torn asunder by civil war, and racked by famine and plague. Desperate, unscrupulous men deserted the temples of their fathers and gathered in forbidden cults, seeking the favor of the Dark Gods. And so it was, in the year 2301, that a Kurgan warlord named Asavar Kul united the savage tribes of the Chaos Wastes and made war upon the realms of men. The invaders entered the distant northern kingdom of Kislev and sacked its largest city, Prague. They sacrificed its people to their dark gods, and any who managed to flee were driven into the freezing wilderness. The Empire seemed powerless to stop the Chaos Horde, and many feared that the end of the world was at hand. But in the Empire's darkest hour, a nobleman from the south named Magnus rallied the people of the Empire to resist the invaders, uniting the warring Elector Counts in the process. The Imperial Army marched to the rescue of the Kislevite capital, fighting Kool's army in a massive battle outside the city walls. Joined by mighty heroes from all across the land, Magnus defeated Kool in single combat, and the Chaos Horde was scattered to the winds. Blessed by the gods, and heralded as the true Emperor, Magnus returned to Nuln in triumph. But even as the old world celebrated Magnus's victory, the Dark Gods were planning their revenge. As a young dwarf in the great city of Karaza Karak, you were taught the legends of your ancestors. Ever since, you have longed for the day when you could win fame and glory of your own and restore the luster of your much-diminished clan. When High King Thorgrim Grudgebearer called for warriors to aid Kislev during the Great Chaos Invasion, you were one of the first to pledge your service. Along with your father and your younger brothers, you left Karaza Karak behind, marching eagerly to war. It wasn't long before you were in the thick of the fight, trapped inside the city of Kislev. You and your kin fought fiercely against the Chaos Horde. When Kul's first assault breached the city gates, it was the dwarfs who led the counterattack that drove the enemy back and saved the day. Your fearlessness in battle earned you the name Axebiter, and the Kislevites hailed you as a hero. But the more you tasted of glory, the more you began to crave it. When Magnus's army arrived outside the city, your thirst for immortal fame ended in tragedy. Leading a force of 300 dwarfs, you tried to fight your way out of the city to join the Imperials and fight Kool's army together. It was a deed worthy of legend, but not even Grimnir himself could have fought his way through so vast a horde. Your reckless charge was driven back at a bitter cost. Half of the valiant dwarfs that had followed you were slain, including your father and all of your brothers. Racked with guilt over the deaths of your kin, you swore powerful oaths of vengeance against the Dark Powers. And so you chose the path of the Slayer, seeking redemption through a glorious death in battle. When the final battle outside the city walls began, you went forth alone to find Asavaku and challenge him to single combat. You carved a bloody path through the enemy, reaching the Chaos Lord in time to see him fall to Magnus and his knights. After the battle, you accepted an invitation from Magnus to join his retinue and return with him to Null. As far as you were concerned, the new Emperor owed you a glorious death, and with many of Asavar Kul's champions still alive, 
you could be sure Magnus would not lack for foes. It was an age of lawlessness and despair. A time of dark magic, treachery, and war. It is a night made for witchery and evil deeds. And across the city, guardsmen clutch their weapons tightly and count the hours until the dawn. Sleep is hard to come by on a night such as this. The air is tense, and memories of the battle at Kislev leave you restless and on edge. Suddenly, a peal of thunder shatters the stillness, followed by a howling wind that shakes the tower to its foundations. Foul magic curdles the air, and screams echo in the courtyard outside. The tower is under attack! What's all that noise? Best take a look. The ancestors. If it's Magnus they want, they'll have to go through me first. I'd best get to the throne room. Thank Sigma, you're here. There's monsters everywhere. The tower's being overrun. I know. Exhilarating, isn't it? Now, where's Magnus? Upstairs in the throne room. There's armor in a chest by the stairs. Take whatever you need, but hurry.
As you reach the throne room, the air seethes with foul magics. The Chaos Sorceress stands before the throne, and Magnus, the savior of the Empire, is caught within her spell. There's only one thing to do. Roaring at battle oaths, you ready your axe and charge! By the time you regain your senses, the battle is over. The Sorceress is gone, leaving you and Magnus for dead. The shouts of angry men fill the throne room. But these are not guardsmen. They are witch hunters. The Empire's feared inquisitors, led by none other than the infamous Heinrich Voss. You are under arrest for the murder of the Emperor Magnus, Voss declares. We try to tell him about the sorceress, but Voss refuses to listen. I see no sorceress here, he shouts. Only you and a room full of dead men. Confess your crimes, dwarf. Boss threatens. We will have the truth from you one way or another. After a week in the dungeons, you'll tell me everything I want to know. But before the witch hunter could make good on his threat, a commanding voice filled the room. Stop this madness at once! Teglis, law master of the High Elves, regards Boss coldly. Braggy Axebiter has told you the truth, he said. It is you who have refused to listen. Teglis examines Magnus in silence. He lives, thank the gods, the High Elf says at last. But he is in the grip of a powerful curse. It is only a matter of time before he succumbs. No one outside this room must know what happened here. If the people learn that Magnus has fallen, then everything he fought for will have been for nothing. The fate of the Empire lies in our hands. We must find this sorceress and end the curse before it's too late. If Magnus dies, the Empire dies with him. There are dark and terrible forces at work in the city, Braggy Axebiter. If we are to find the sorceress and defeat her, we must confront the dark cult that has taken root in Nuln and expose its secret master. Just tell me where I can find them, elf. My axe will take care of the rest. The attack on the tower came from the sewers that stretch beneath the city. So long as the enemy controls the tunnels surrounding the tower, our position here is vulnerable. Your first task is simple. Enter the tunnels and drive the cultists back from the tower. Kill everything in your path, but beware. There is no telling what foul things await you in the darkness. Ha! By Grimnir, I hope you're right!
Give him a little respite!
I need more time. Hell myself. I need more time.
It's done. There's nothing in the tunnels outside the tower except dead men. Plenty of signs that there are more cultists deeper in the sewers, though, or I'm no dwarf. I do not doubt it. The servants of Nurgle flourish in darkness and filth. Our battle against the cult has only just begun. Well done. Return to me when you are ready for your next task. There is grim news from the tower. Voss has learned that a large group of Magnus's guardsmen have gone missing. He believes they might have pursued the cultists into the sewers during the attack. So? I'd have done the same if that damn sorceress hadn't blasted me off my feet. They've been gone too long, Bracky. Either they've gotten lost in the tunnels, or the cultists have cut them off. Someone must go in after them and bring them out.
second, and I'll crush them all! The blood rush! <laughs> Just another second and I'll crush them all! Let's give them a little rest, fight! for that. Another second, and I'll crush them all! I must return to the fight! I need to fight! Just another second, and I'll crush them all! No! I need more time!
little respite. Return to the fight! I've lost the blood rush!
I need to fight him. into a trap. Try to fight, but too many of them. Easy now, lad. You and your men fought well. Now let's get you on your feet and back to the tower. They took them, and I went still able to walk. Dragged them, screaming, into the darkness. Forget about me. Find the others. I've lost the blood rush!
found your lost warriors. They'd been trapped by the cultists and surrounded. For what it's worth, they died well. Most of them, at least. And the others? They were taken alive? Not much point taking them if they're dead, is it? What does the cult want with a handful of prisoners, though? Not prisoner. Sacrifices. Offerings to the Lord of Pestilence in exchange for more power. We must do everything we can to prevent this. Go, and make whatever preparations you require. Then return to me as soon as you are ready. There is no time to waste. Even as we speak, the cultists could be preparing to sacrifice their captives. If they succeed... They won't. By iron and stone, I swear it. The enemy will do everything in their power to keep you from reaching the captives in time. Choose your battles wisely. Now go. Save my life. No, I need more time. I need to focus.
I need to fight! Oh, I need to focus. I need to fight! I must return to the fight! I've lost the blood rush! I need to fight! Just another second and I'll crush them all! I won't forget. You saved my life, thank you. You saved my life. Maybe one day I'll do the same for you. I've lost the blood rush! I need more time! I must return to the fight! I won't forget this, friend. Thank you. No! I need more time!
The blood rush. Need to fight! I must return to the fight!
You can stop worrying, Elf. The captives are safe. The cultists never knew what hit them. Well done. The Chaos Gods withhold their gifts from those who fail them. This will weaken the cult and increase our chances for victory. Now is the time to press our advantage. Return to me as soon as you are ready. Since the attack, we have been on the defensive, reacting to the enemy's plans. That ends now. We must seek out and destroy the cult's source of power if we are to end its reign of terror here in Nuln. About time we took the fight to the enemy. So, how do I find this source of power? The cult must have camps scattered throughout the sewers. Find one and capture its leader. He will tell us what we need to know. the blood rush!
must return to the fight! I need to fight! I need to fight! I've lost the blood rush! If I die, I will fall. I must return to the fight! Return to the fight!
I need to fight! I need to fight! Return to the fight! I smell dwarf flash! Kill the unbeliever! I need to fight! Return to the fight! I need to focus! I need to focus. Oh, I need more time! I've lost the blood rush! I need to fight!
I've lost the blood rush. Nagel, what, you elf? May the Lord of Pestilence turn your guts to slime! Silence, Chaos Filth. Speak when you're spoken to, or you'll get another taste of elven steel. you a prisoner, but good luck getting any sense out of him. He's more beast than man. Leave him here. I'll have the answers I seek, one way or another. Return to me when you are ready. All will be made clear then. Fortune is with us. The Ungor required very little persuasion to turn on his human allies. The creature says the leader of the cult is a man named Friedrich Kessler, and has offered to lead us directly to the cult's shrine, located deep within the sewers. You expect me to trust this goat man? This has nothing to do with trust. If there is one thing that all followers of Chaos have in common, it's supreme self-interest. They will betray anyone and anything in order to protect themselves. Faced with certain death, the monster will not hesitate to turn on his former friends. Yeah? Then what's to stop him from doing the same to me? The prospect of a beheading can be very persuasive, or so I'm told. Yeah.
Selvish! Rise! Spawn of Nurgle! Slay the unbeliever for the glory of the Plague God! <laughs> Fight!
I need to fight! to the fight! I need to fight! I must return to the fight! Too weak. I don't have the energy.
Second, and I'll crush them all! I need to fight! the blood rush. Beastman played you for a fool, elf. Led me right into a den of monsters, he did. By Grimnir, what a fight! I had not expected this. No mere human cult could command such loyalty from an Ungor. You're not making sense. If not the cults, then who? I do not know. And that troubles me. If the Servants of Chaos would sooner die than give up their secrets, then we must find another way to reach their hidden shrine. 
And I suppose you've got some clever new plan all worked out. Go on then, let's have it. Heinrich Voss has more experience with these chaos cults than anyone else in Nuln. Speak with him. Perhaps he knows a way to obtain the information we seek. Maybe if I chop his head and shake it, something useful will fall out. What was that? I said I was looking forward to picking the witch hunter's brain about our little problem, that's all. Why? What did you think I said? 